So National Officiating Scholarships is the Australian Sports Commission's vehicle for servicing high performance officials. We, we see the officials as athletes, we treat them like athletes and we believe that this will be a more rounded official creating a better spectacle and highlighting how great our sport and our sporting achievements have been. Well the NOS program for, National, for the National Rugby League has become a significant part of our development program for our officials. We've had over many years now great success with all of our scholarship uh, holders. Not only do they develop their core skills uh, back with the National Rugby League but what the scholarship program offers them is, is, is the opportunity to become more well-rounded individuals. All the professional development opportunities that they get uh, enhance their ability to be able to pick up those core skills when they're, when they're doing their skills training and the overall package of them as an official is, uh, is a much better outcome for us and it, uh, you know, it's, it's proving beneficial to us. You know, we've, a lot of our academy officials over the last three years have gone on to uh, already achieve part-time status in the NRL. We presented to the European, our European constituents over in France last year in 2014 and from word of mouth our program has reached across to the US and the president of NASO, so the National Association of Sports Officials, has personally invited us to come and speak to the, some of the major sports and their attendees at the summit this year. We're talking sports, the National Football League, so your NFL, your NBA, uh, Major League Baseball will be there, um, Fox Sports will be there. So it's not just about the officials, it's about some officiating products. Also National Hockey League, US Tennis, US Athletics, and most of the university sports will be, in, um, be there as well. Our officials are, are pretty well prepared anyway. NOS, uh, NOS certainly helps that, there's no doubt about it. You know, we, our officials uh, that have gone on to referee at the NRL, uh, and either in a part-time or a full-time contracted basis, uh, all of the NOS officials over recent years, probably since about 2006, with the exception of a very small number, have gone on to get that status. And you know, and the, you know, it's that's it's more than just a coincidence that you know the NOS officials have, have done that. 2015 is a great success story for female officials, especially in the high performance environment. This year is the first year that we've actually had officials from female officials from rugby league, rugby union, and cricket. Um, the more male dominated sports. For to have the National Officiating Scholarships recognised internationally, I think it's a real boost for officiating within Australia. The feedback that we've got for over the last couple of years is that we are so far in front of the rest of the world in what we're doing and how we're treating our officials. And some of our programs that have come from it, so like our National, the, the National Rugby League Academy, the AFL um, Academy, your Netball Academies, Crickets, Emerging Umpires Academies and so on, have uh, really come from this program. So it's a great boost for us.